a notification the site cannot be reached click on details and you're gonna see all these other several details so what are the several reason for that check your internet connection and maybe antivirus or the firewall is blocking the IP address or if you use proxy server so step by step follow the guides if you would like to fix the problem so you're gonna see three dotted lines over here a three dash line click on that and then you're gonna go to the settings click on settings and come down click on advance so obviously if you are using the different browser check somewhere for the open proxy setting so this is in chrome so once you click on advance you are going to click over here open proxy settings and then click on connection so once you choose this tab connection click on LAN settings and uncheck this box and check this one so automatically detect setting and click on OK click on OK once you have done that make sure you check it once again in connection LAN settings OK automatically detect settings click on OK and then make sure you restart the PC and check if it is working or not so if that do not fix your issue so you can see this network icon in your tax bar so right click on it and click on troubleshoot problem so it starts detecting the problem and then it gonna fix it so this is the second method so the third method is give a right click on it and click on open network and internet settings once you open that click on this ethernet and then click on change adapter settings then after you have this so give a right click on it and then click on properties once you click on properties select this internet protocol version 4 TCP IP version 4 select this and then click on properties so make sure that you have selected over here obtain an IP address automatically obtain a DNS server address automatically so make sure you have choose this automatic option so if you are using this IP address and DNS server manually you want to choose automatically so if you are already choosing if you are already using the automatically even try putting this DNS an IP address manually so if it is manually change it to automatic and then click on OK click on close so this should fix your problem so this was another step to follow go to the search and type CMD or you can type command prompt right click on it run as administrator click on yes and here you have command prompt as an administrator make a note of all these commands watch it in a full screen make a note of all these commands one by one you're gonna type these commands in a command prompt be sure to hit enter after each command type the each commands and after typing each commands you're gonna click on enter 
So one by one type the commands and press enter key. Finally restart your computer once you finish typing all the command and pressing enter. Restart your computer and then you can check it. The problem like the site cannot be reached and several other common internet problems should be solved. My computer or this PC. Give a right click on it and click on manage. In a few seconds you will see this. Computer management. Here you have device. Click on device. Once you click on device, you have to select the network adapter. Right? What you need to do is, you can see here is the network adapter. Give a right click on it and click on a scan for the hardware change. Alright, click on a scan for the hardware change. Follow the steps for a couple of time or you can go to the properties. So you do not have anything in the properties. Click on a scan for the hardware change for a couple of time. You can update the driver, disable it and enable it back again. So better update the driver. Do not follow these steps. It might be difficult for you to enable or install again if you uninstall it so if you are sure that you can install it again if you have a driver then only follow this step otherwise scan for the hardware change and update the driver you can do for all the network adapters 